Welcome back to the 21st episode of a close combat Bartam Rhein playthrough with the allies in the grand campaign on late difficulty and we are once again defending Dasburg against uh, Kochenhausen or however you say that because I'm sure I'm saying it wrong. Um, either way let's have a look here. They Well I mean I see we can reinforce so maybe that's something to look into. What are we doing like on AT guns? We have 357 mils left. Uh, well, first off, let's see what the enemy has. Like, the deployment zones are going to be like this. Right, okay. Hmm. I see some issues with that. Let's reinforce. Ah, three infantry. Or three, uh, new three-inch anti-tank guns. Could come in very handy. Let's see. That's good enough for second platoon. We'll give these guys another Panzer Pioneer group. Heavy machine gun team isn't necessarily what you want when you're attacking. At least, maybe not what the AI wants when he's attacking, because... Well, the AI is kind of trash, as we all know. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, this will be it for them. And now time to uh, have a look at my own guys. I kind of don't want to remove these bazooka teams. They're all experienced. Hmm. And anti-tank guns aren't doing too bad either. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 bazooka teams. Right, three, 6 bazooka teams. Plus these anti-tank guns, that's nine, and we have this tank. I mean... I, yeah, like, this could work. Kinda. And because all these guys are experienced now, that could come in extremely handy, if I'm being honest. Because they might actually hit the shots, so I, I'm reluctant to uh, change them out for, for fresh forces. We might have reinforced too soon. Honestly, I don't think you should be able to reinforce. Uh, because it just makes things go on. For, like, you get a whole new battle group when your battle group is almost depleted. Like, I, I don't know. Uh, not 100% on board uh, with that one, personally. But, oh well, what am I going to do? Either way, uh, what I am going to do is set up a bunch of stuff to shoot the enemy. Um, and I guess an anti-tank gun down here could do the trick. I feel like we're just fighting over and over and over in these places now and it's not really going anywhere because the enemy just has too much good armor and we just don't, so. I mean, I might need to get some armor divisions in here to fight, but the thing is, if I do, I give away all the ground that I control. Like, we need to rotate our guys out and then come in with a new team, giving away the position that we already have to begin with. And it's just, I don't know, I'm not 100% on board with that. Maybe an anti-tank gun here could be good. Uh, maybe not exactly there. I don't want to be able to shoot. Oh, screw it. We're going to shoot from here. Okay, it needs to be more like here. Yeah, that will be fine, I guess. Oh, yeah, we still have a 3 inch, actually. could put this here, I think. Oh, we, we have the 3 inch again, I guess I should be saying. Uh, and then I don't know, from here, can we shoot? Not really. I just want to be able to get some shots down here. To some degree we can do it from there, so. And, uh, let's see, a 57mm over here, maybe? Might get some sneaky shots off into the city. Uh, Uh, and the thing is, we can't put it in a good spot anymore, because we dug out a fucking uh, position for the anti-tank guns, but we can It's so stupid. Like, you can only deploy in these things the time you dig them out, and then you can never use them ever again. In fact, y you're, you're gonna be, like, anti-magnetized or whatever the fuck the word is, away from those positions, which is just silly. Simply silly. But oh well, let's get a bazooka team maybe put up here. Um, I mean, we can get some in this building, for sure. Maybe one, maybe two, who knows. Uh, yeah, let's just make it two. Hope they don't get simultaneously annihilated, that would kind of suck a bit. I also want, like, a bazooka team over here, just an ambush in case for some tanks here. They might be able to shoot. 
and remain undetected until they do. Uh, yeah, well, I put the bazooka team on ambush over here as well. Then I would like, let's see, maybe a rifle team in the back here if any infantry tries to push up on the bazooka team still. And also, let's have a platoon leader team here so we can move in and take some other buildings. Then where's the last bazooka team? We have one over here. Which I would also just kind of put here, I think. Then the rifle team. Well, let's have one of these as well here. So we can kind of make some moves here later on. Um, Fall team over here, maybe. So we can sneak them out this way and go take these buildings for future deployment. I'm not really banking on us uh, winning right now, but I mean, it could happen. Probably isn't gonna, but let's just try to do as much damage as we can. All right, let's begin. Fuck that thing up, fuck that thing up, fuck that. Damn it, it's gonna fuck up anti tank gun. There we go, that's pretty much destroyed. Uh, it's getting some damage though. But if we can sneak a bit closer, it would be better. Hmm. Well, I'm not entirely sure what the situation is right now. Okay, good. Is that a 3 inch of firing now, though? Seemingly. Oof. Yeah, I guess I knew that was going to happen. Oh well, what am I gonna do? At least this 57 mil here is doing some damage to this panther. If I start telling it directly to fire it though, it won't. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it's a bit silly, but what are you gonna do? Uh, either way, I mean, we're, we're at least shooting at several of the enemy tanks. We're not necessarily hitting all of them, but... Or uh, damaging all of them with our shots, but... We're putting out some shells here, so that's good. We've taken out, what, two so far? Uh, could be better. Could be worse. Let's sneak these guys in a bit, uh... So, I mean, yeah, I mean, we just let them do what they're doing and uh, farm the Panthers as they make moves, basically. That's another one down. Very nice. Hey, what's up with these guys? I mean, they just got endless streams of Panthers, basically. Okay, what's this Panther G shooting at? He needs to go down first, please. Shoot this fucker. Get this Panther, please. Ooh, come on. God damn it. Well, that was our best anti-tank gun. Oh, we got this one finally, nice. Actually taking a bit of casualties on this one, huh? Thing is though, if we can move in and take some of these buildings for the next deployment phase, then we're in a good position. And Panzer Pioneers over here, switch to defend, let's engage them more actively. Switch over to platoon leaders here, take these guys in here as well, and let's just get on them. Right, and I would like the bazooka team here to... Oh, well, here comes the tank. These guys should be able to get there. If we can take these guys out, we can maybe take this row of houses or Oh, we don't really have any infantry on the back here. Ooh. Hmm. Wait, why are these guys going out in the open road like this? That's by far not anywhere near what I told them to do. Right, shoot at the damn panther, you're gonna be seen. Fantastic, now shoot to the fucking infantry. Kill those fuckers, god damn it. Men are starting to panic, yeah. Well, what can I say? Look at these idiots, that's what I can say. I mean, holy shit. 
I'm not even going to move these bazooka guys. I'm just going to move in here. Try to... Oh, fuck's sake. Now we need to push something up and retake that. God fucking damn it. The yeah, they want a ceasefire. We'll give them a ceasefire, but we're going to take Dustburg first, though. And then we need to... Fuck. It really sucks that they took this bridge waypoint there now. The victory location. <sighs> if we had some more infantry, they wouldn't, but... Just keep moving, keep moving, keep fucking moving, take the victory location, go. The Panthers are kind of moving away, so they're not going to be that useful. Just, just please, go, take this, we take the truce, we call it a day. It's not worse than that. Actually, maybe we can, ah, oh, nah, you know what, we're, fuck. Uh, the AI, I hate AI in this game. Absolute trash and horrendous sometimes. Just take this victory location, we'll take the truce. Please, it's going to give us a good fighting chance to actually win this next time. Secure it entirely, fully. It's secured, good. We take the truce. Fuck it. We'll leave it at that. We can deploy in some houses here now. They can, however, deploy their Panthers further out. And, uh, yeah. Well, I mean, things are getting better and are getting worse. Mostly worse, I would say. But, what are you going to do? Anyway, yeah, well, let's have a look at the details, sir. We destroyed five tanks and we damaged one. So... At least we got something down there. They took out two of our guns and damaged our tank, actually. They damaged it? How? It was just hiding behind a house the entire time. What happened? What? What the fuck happened to our steward? Oh, it doesn't even really matter that much, but... Yeah, there you go. Um, they just have so many Panthers. It's I could set them up differently, I guess, but... Oh, well. Either way, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you left a like on it. And as always, thank you for watching. You can catch me in the next one. So, have a good one.